Phil Murphy here alongside Diego Lima, a split decision winner at UFC 243 on the pay-per-view Marvel Stadium. Diego, first, you're there. A lot of people had you winning this pretty comfortably. Mm -hmm. When you hear it's a split decision, what's going through your mind? Ah, uh, scared. I shook a little bit. I was like, come on, again? <laughs> you know? Like, I clearly thought I had a unanimous on this one, but, you know, got the win, man. That's what matters. It sucked, though. It wasn't, not going to lie. It was like, really? And it's his hometown. I'm like, Ugh, you know? So, <laughs> but I clearly thought I won. From what we saw out of you in the octagon, how closely did that resemble what your game plan was going into this fight? Man, it resembled everything. I followed it to a T, you know. I, um, I, w I wanted to box a little bit more, get a few more takedowns, but, you know, he had really good distance, and he was never there. So, you know, hit him with the kicks. You know, I, I got long legs, so the kicks were working. I dropped him a few times with the kicks. So, you know, I, I waited for him to readjust, and he didn't. So, you know, clearly decision for me, clearly, won for, uh, clearly win for me, you know. <laughs> You've said you're enjoying yourself now more as a mixed martial artist. It looks like that. You have a lot of energy right now post-fight after going 15 minutes. To what do you credit that, that renewed enjoyment? To my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, man. You know, I let him take care of everything. I don't worry about anything. I'm just enjoying. If he put me for a reason, you know, and, you know, I'm enjoying my time now, man. I'm happy. I found myself. And, you know, one step at a time. <laughs> This is your second UFC stint, now three and two since returning to this promotion. Mm -hmm. How have you evolved as a fighter from the first time we saw you in the UFC back in, what, 2015 to now? Just the experience, I'm, I'm thinking, you know. The experience is the most, man. I've been there, done that. I've been so bad in the sport. I've been in the, on the ups now. So, you know, I've been everywhere in the sport. And, and you can see the experience, you know. It's just the pre-fight, man, post-fight, during the fight, everything, you know. It's just, it's normal now, you know. There's no, of course, you always get those butterflies. But before, you saw so tense before. Now, you know, letting it happen and just enjoying the process. With all that experience, you should be accustomed to this question. What is next for you, ideally? <laughs> we'll see, man. Let me go enjoy my kids, enjoy the family, and, you know, put it in God's hands, man. I'll make my plans, and we'll see. I don't have any plans yet. You know, I know we got Christmas coming up, Thanksgiving, you know. Yeah, I, I have three kids, man. Those are the favorite ones. So I got to see. I don't like being in camp in the middle of that. So we'll see. We'll see. I feel good, you know, no injuries. So, you know, my brother's got a big fight coming up. I got to focus on him, and then my coach got a big fight coming up. So, you know, the whole camp is fighting and now it's my turn to help them. And if anything pops up, we'll see, you know, we'll see. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports and analysis, download the ESPN app. And for live streaming and special content, subscribe to ESPN+.